This week on the RC Shop, we clock and drop the motor in the Highway 1 project. So why clock a motor in a truck? Well, it's quite simple, to drop the center of gravity. So let's start by pulling the engine bay apart, starting with the bumper. With that out of the way, I can clip the wires loose and disconnect the motor. Now let's get this 45 turn motor out of here. and drop the steering link. And now we can get that servo out of the way. With the engine bay cleared out, I can remove the motor mounts and pull out the clutch. So let's talk about what does clocking a motor mean? You can see there are multiple mounting points on the motor plate, like hours on a clock. If we remove some metal bits, we can rotate the motor plate like a clock and drop the motor for a lower center of gravity. By removing these bits, we'll open up room for the motor to sit lower. We'll also have to remove this tab to clear the frame well when clocked. Here's all the pieces that we'll need to cut. So let's get my favorite tool out and start cutting. And guys, always wear your safety glasses. So I give the parts a final cleanup, a coat of paint for that creepy crawler caliber finish. I started reassembly and you see you have to clock it far enough around so the motor sits underneath the frame rail. My first attempt was a fail. So I found a good tip is to go ahead and mount the motor to the motor plate in order to find the optimal mounting position.
You'll then have to pull the motor assembly back apart to get the clutch back in. Make sure you know and have made a guide for your spring clutch tension. Now we can get the motor assembly back in in its new lower position. Use a small sliver of paper to set your gear mesh. Now our center of gravity is lower, that's a good thing. But now we have steering linkage issues. That's going to have to wait for next week. For now, we've got the motor dropped. Stick around, check out Jeff's all metal wraith that he's building for Axial Fest this year. Thanks for watching guys. Hit that subscribe button, hit the like button, do your thing, and I'll see you guys next week.